frequently check-in station. Please, no cutting in line. If you are caught cutting in line, you will be sent straight to hell. <laughs> so, Mr. Popo! Yes, call me. I just received word that we have a new batch of trainees coming. Make sure you take good care of them. Of course, it's Mr. Popo. Just OP for no reason. <laughs> Ooh, what's up guys, my name is Dar Red and welcome back to another reaction video. Today we got for you guys Dragon Ball Z Episode 3 by Team Four Star. I'm not sure where this accent came from, I'm not even sure what it is. Last episode we got into it and uh, Goku got killed by Raddins, you know, Piccolo took Gohan and everything like that. So we're going to see what's happening here. Uh, obviously if you know the actual show, it's going to the same, further into the Saiyan Saga. And as I said, when it comes to the movies, I'll put them in where they're supposed to be at. I think there's like two movies after the Saiyan Saga ends, World's Strongest and um, the Christmas special with Turles that I saw in here. So without further ado, subscribe if you're new, comment if you want to see next. Without further ado, let's get into the video. I don't know why I have my eyes closed, don't even ask. Legiri. The following is a fan-based parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Venimation Toy Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. Well, Goku is oh. past, hey, here we go. but his sacrifice has stopped a great evil. Thanks to him, our lives can return to peace once more. Raditz. Raditz. What the hell is that? Guy who's as strong as the Cybermen says what? <laughs> that usually gets to him. I think he's dead, Vegeta. Big shocker, nobody cares. We're ten times stronger than him anyway. We'll go to Earth, find the Dragon Balls, and kill everyone. And we'll be there within a year or so. Mm -hmm. Depending on filler, of course. Anything else we need to go over, Vegeta? Nope. That's about it. Well, fuck. I'm gonna just make it up every time. I just gotta make sure I end like this. At this point, it's just different every time. All right, you little human Saiyan thing. That's about right. I saw what you did to that Saiyan back there. That kind of power can be useful. What? What do you mean? I'm going to make you my pupil, and then I'll use you for my conquest to take over the world. But but where's my daddy? Hate to tell you, kid, but your dad's dead. Actually, I kind of like saying that. Ha <laughs> ha, your dad's dead. Yeah. Damn it. This is why I hang out in wastelands. Is it? Hello, and welcome to the heavenly check-in station. Please, no cutting in line. If you are caught cutting in line, you will be sent straight to hell. <laughs> so, we need Goku here to get to King Guys for his masterful training, Lord Yama. Give me one good reason I should allow this. Because if you don't, that line's going to increase by six billion! Six billion? I'm supposed to be intimidated by six billion? Of course not. Please! I can judge six billion souls faster than you take a piss, old man! You know, I am the guardian of Earth. Could I please get a little bit more respect here? No. Big deal, I'm the closest thing to a god in this show. Until you get to the Kais. Yeah. Then I'll be horribly insignificant. Very. I do have a desk, though. It's made of mahogany. Mahogany. <laughs> uh, anyway, can we please- SILENCE! Mahogany. Mahogany. <laughs> um, sir? Well, what? Oh, uh, sure, whatever. He can go to King Kai's, but he'll have to run on Snake Way. Sounds fun. Prepare to be surprised. Alright, I'm off. Oh, wait. By the way, did you see a guy named Raditz come through here? He has spiky hair and a tail? Oh yeah, I remember that guy. I put him in my patented Yamalock. And it worked? No, he kicked me in the balls and ran away. <laughs> now I don't know where he is. He didn't keep his eye on the birdie. Huh. Okay. True enough. Well, bye. See you next time you die. Mahogany. Mahogany. Yeah, okay. 
So, Krillin, how did Chi-Chi take the news? Um... He didn't tell her. Well, Krillin, what did you need to talk about? So, Chi-Chi, hypothetically, what would you do if you were told that your husband was dead mm -hmm. and your son were kidnapped by his worst enemy? I'd castrate the messenger in his sleep with a rusty carving knife. Ugh. Oh, but it's a good thing I'm not telling you that. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to spend the night? Absolutely uh, not. Against my better judgment. You. <laughs> you. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> to snore like that. <laughs> Getting up out of here, that's where I'm at. Mm-hmm. Relatively well. So, are you going to get out of the other Z-Warriors and go train with Kami? The who warriors? The Z-Warriors. You, Goku, where did that scar Dian, come from? Yamcha, Chiaotzu? <laughs> that's what we always call you guys. That's the stupidest thing I've ever- Krillin! Where the hell are you? Mm. Well, I'm off to gather the Z-Warriors. Bye! <laughs> Listen up, Runt. Today we're going to commence your intense training under me. Mm -hmm. But wait, wouldn't that cause horrible muscle degeneration for somebody my age? Crippling me for years to come? You're, You're a wordy little bastard, aren't, aren't you? you? <laughs> my mom wants me to become an orthodox- NERD! Wh what? <laughs> anyway, I figured to unleash your hidden potential, I'd have to put you in immense physical danger. So I'm gonna throw you at that mountain. Actually, that looks more like a plat- <laughs> Any second now. Here it comes. Splat. And... <laughs> this is gonna be a long training session. Alright, Mr. Must Man, here you are at Snake Way. Ugh. Now, you might wanna pack a lunch, cause it's gonna be a long run. Nah, I'm just joking, you're not gonna be eating none. <laughs> wow! That looks like it's gonna take me a while. Now be careful running, you don't want to fall off and die. That's just a little bit of dead humor. But seriously, do not fall off or you will go to hell. Oh. Has anyone ever run the whole <laughs> thing before? Well, there was one man. Well, who was he? I believe his name was... Mr. Popo! <laughs> yes, call me. I just received word that we have a new batch of trainees coming. Make sure you take good care of them. Of course it's Mr. Popo. Just OP for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot how creepy he is in this abridged version. And not just any mahogany, but mahogany from the planet of Malkior 7, where the trees are 300 feet tall and breathe fire! From these trees, this desk was forged 2,000 years ago mm. using ancient blood rituals of the Malkior people. <laughs> Not only does this make my desk nigh indestructible, but it can bend the fabric of the universe itself. Huh. Also, it's a very fine material. Very expensive. Okay. Mahogany. Mahogany. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, hit the like button, comment, subscribe, and share. If you have any requests, comment at the bottom of this video. Hit me on my social media, which will be in the description below. Subscribe and comment what you want to see next. Till the next video, you guys. See ya.